Former interim UFC lightweight champion Dustin Poirier appears raring to go in 2024. Poirier, who currently occupies the number 3 spot at 155 pounds, was most recently in action at UFC 291 this past July in Salt Lake City. There, he ran it back with Justin Gaethje in pursuit of a third opportunity at the undisputed title. Although, the diamond, had got the better of him back in 2018, he failed to repeat the feat second time around, with, the highlight, sleeping Poirier courtesy of a brutal second round head kick. Following his previous loss against Charles Oliveira in December 2021, Poirier appeared devoid of motivation and retirement even appeared to be up in the air. But that's been far from the case since the setback against Gaethje. Immediately after the loss in Utah, Poirier outlined his desire to bounce back before the end of the calendar year. While that ultimately won't be coming to fruition, the diamond, remains willing to step into the cage soon. That was the message that the ex-interim champ gave to MMA Fighting's Mike Heck in a recent interview, while also pinpointing next year's historic UFC 300 event as his desired return date should noting appealing arise beforehand. I think I fit where I have for the last decade. I've been a top 10, top 5 fighter, and my track record proves that, for the last 10 years plus, Poirier said. So, I'm never far away from the biggest fights possible, and I train every day like it. Right now, my current mindset, I'd fight in 6 weeks, I'd fight in 8 weeks if the fight made sense and I was excited about it, Poirier continued. Other than that, the chance to fight in UFC 300 is a big deal. I've been in the UFC since UFC 125. I missed 200. I know I'm not gonna be around for 400. So, it's kind of a cool opportunity if it comes together. UFC 300 is enticing. Poirier shared the same sentiment on social media, posting a cryptic, UFC 300, tweet earlier this week. Many are predicting that a blockbuster showdown between the Louisiana native's former opponents, Conor McGregor and Michael Chandler, will top the card's lineup. If that's the case, the Diamond, will evidently be looking to join them.